It's a normal life. And then the last one, Salman, your excitement in joining the squad. Um, how have the guys um, welcomed you in, in the in the squad? Hello, Ethan. Um, it's been it's been really special. Um, obviously, as you can as you can think, um, it's been really nice to join up with the guys. Um, as Coach John said, now this camp or this week that we have is actually quite ideal just to get to know how they do things around in the, in the environment and get to know how they how they operate. Um, the guys have been really welcoming, and uh, it's been it's been really good. You may. Thank you so much, ma'am. Uh, once again, good afternoon, uh, Salman. Can I start with you? Salman, can I just ask you, um, this is possibly a question I'm going to possibly ask the coach as well. Um, as a newcomer in the squad, you are also very uh, senior when it comes to the, uh, the Stormers and, and, and your, your background as a SA under-20 player. What does it feel like being part of this squad, knowing there's a possibility that you guys are going to prepare this week in France, knowing that this could possibly be the hunting ground in 2023. Is that possibly something that's in the, in the back of your head, perhaps? Um, yeah, I think um, as a group, obviously, you do you do plan, but you do plan for, for, for the next World Cup. But I think for, on, a, on a personal note, I'm pretty sure that our focus will be on the next four weeks. Um, obviously, to, to play really good rugby and to, to get the results. Um, so, I don't know if that answers your question, but I think I think the goal would be obviously to play play good rugby and, and to do well the next couple of weeks. Yeah. Uh, just just before we do um, in the section of the of the press conference, um, Salman, I, just having been a, a former uh, SA Schools captain, former uh, junior Springbok captain, uh, can you just tell us about your pathway, you know, into the Springbok team and and, and having been involved in the South African structures, um, you know, all these years. As you, know, as you mentioned, uh, I've, I've been privileged enough to, to have represented so I've played at, at school level and under 20 levels. So um, I've, I've been through that system and I've, I've been to one or two training camps before where I've, obviously I've had, I've had a quality eye out to that as to what it takes to, to, to hopefully you know, make, make my way into the squad. Um, and now obviously I'm very privileged to, to be here. Um, as I mentioned earlier, um, it's extremely special to myself, my family, um, and hopefully I can become a better rugby player over the next four weeks. Um, and yeah, and hopefully if the opportunity comes, uh, I, I can be ready for that.